My name is Neil Diane Hassan. I work for the African Centre for Cities in Cape Town. So my research for the Peak Urban Project specifically focuses on how men who have sex with men are being prioritised in Cape Town um, alongside um, concepts of health and sexuality. It tries to engage this multi-scalar concept. Um, so largely policy, health policies are being promoted and developed um, by international bodies. And um, so I'm trying to critically understand and, and engage this concept of scale um, from the international and how that filters to the national, to the provincial and to the city level. Um, especially how do um, the voices of those that are um, at the, the community level, how are their voices being prioritised? In a nutshell, it is looking at um, the top-down approach and how the bottom-up approach filters into prioritisation of health. So for the first time, um, HIV prevention and treatment is being framed at s within a urban framework. Um, the SDGs are SDG 11 is calling to make um, cities safe. Um, and so when we think about concepts or ideas of men who have sex with men, um, there is a large amount of stigma around that. And so how exactly do people who are marginalized, how, what does safety mean to, to them? How exactly are their voices and their health ne needs, which are extremely unique, so to, to say, how is that being addressed? Um, so when we think of the urban, spaces are largely also sexualized, but um, a lot of urban frameworks do not take that into account. And when, so my project essentially is trying to understand how within health, health spaces, health care spaces, are we thinking about um, engaging those that are marginalized? Also, largely, um, research has also shown that um, healthcare spaces are quite violent because of how heteronormative they are programmed to be. Um, and so, right now, there is a, ma a major push to include people, but what does it mean to be included? Um, and so, I believe that my research would be able to comment to an extent on, um, on things that are not really thought of um, especially from a stakeholder engagement perspective, thinking that we have multiple stakeholders and these stakeholders come from various backgrounds. Um, policy makers don't really have a social understanding of um, unique health needs related to key populations, whether it is men who have sex with men, sex workers, transgender people. Um, and so my research is trying to, to a large extent, um, push an understanding, push a level of, of getting to a table and promoting mutual understanding and also looking at how can we benefit from such programming that again comes from international policies.